Did you know that sometime in the late Calculusic, human figured out that if you melt copper together with other metal like tin, it becomes harder. And that period is called the Bronze Age. Today, I will discuss to you the Bronze Age. It began 3000 BC in Mesopotamia and China and around 2300 BC in Europe. It was the time when people first started using metal bronze. Bronze is a mixture of copper and tin. People used bronze in making tools, weapons, and farming tools. These were stronger and more durable than copper tools and weapons. There were variety of bronze tools made like flanged axes, diggers, and halberds, and socketed axe in late Bronze Age. Metal workers and those who traded metals were the most important and wealthiest people in Bronze Age society. Because of them, some leaders like kings built armies and outfitted them with bronze spears, arrows, swords, and shields. Did you know that during Bronze Age, animal drawn vehicles made from bronze were used? As population grew, farming became more important as food was needed. Large areas of forests were cleared using bronze socketed axes, diggers, and bronze plows. That was the start of proper fields. The title inventors of agriculture might go with the Sumerians who started farming from 5,500 BC. Barley was their primary crop, but wheat, flax, dates, apples, plums, vegetables, and grapes were grown as well. Because of agriculture, they invented irrigation system using man-made canals and ditches in watering the land. Also, they had the field system which rotates the crops planted in a number of fields to replenish nutrients in the soil. Thus, irrigation system and field system changed the face of farming. To account their harvests, the Sumerians developed the cuneiform system of writing, the first written language in the history. The people in the Bronze Age lived in round houses with a wattle and daub walls or dry stone walls. Some houses had to be built on stilts as they were constructed on wet lands. During the Bronze Age, both men and women wore long tunics typically woven of wool and hemp. They had covering over their tops too. In China, because they were able to domesticate silkworms, the wealthier people wore silk garments. We also saw the first use of textile production in Bronze Age. People also wore hats, belts, and leather shoes. And most clothing was in a dark color. With the use of bronze, people built large blocks of stones called megaliths to build monuments statues, and tombs. 
These were used in ceremonial or ritualistic structures. Did you know that these were fitted together without the use of mortar or cement? They also built stone circles called hinges. These were used as places of burials. The purpose of stone circles was probably connected to agricultural events. Some people built new burial tombs called round barrows. They were often found under small mounds. Bronze, flints, stone tools, ambers, and bone jewelries have been found in the burials. As Bronze Age progressed, cremation became more common with ashes being deposited in a small pit or pottery urn in a barrow. The early man went on to discover new metals until he discovered the iron. And that was the start of the Iron Age. Thank you for listening. Bye.